So 220 Melbourne is at North Jackson neighborhood uh, it's in Broad Meadow. Um, and 220 Melbourne is, uh, so it's just kind of uh, east of the Little Caesars on State Street. This is Melbourne Street right here. I'm looking south, so that's west. The Little Caesars, the Big Apple Inn is all kind of right there. Um, so we're just south of Northside Drive. I just want to give you a video tour of this house. I think you are going to love it. So this is the living room when you come in and you notice immediately it's got fresh paint. And then as you look a little bit closer, you realize, wow, like that's not the only thing. <laughs> all new flooring uh, all throughout the house. Let me get over here on this side show it to you. You'll notice, too, great light in this house. Really great light. New mini blinds as well. All right, let me show you the dining area. And then just wait till you see the kitchen. You're going to love it. It is huge. Let me turn this light on for you. Okay, there we go. Um, oh, got a smoke detector that needs a battery. But uh, here's the dining area here. I'll get over here so you kind of see back looking towards the living area. You can have a couple different furniture configurations. It might work best to have the TV in that corner or on uh, maybe here or there. You can have your sofa there maybe and TV over there. Uh, all right, now the kitchen as I've been promising. Isn't it cute? It's so good looking. Such a good looking kitchen. So you got a new sink, you got new countertops, you got new cabinets, you got a new dishwasher, new upper cabinets, new vena hood. I mean, this thing is brand new. And when the tenant moves in, you'll get a brand new stove. It'll be an electric range that goes right here. And then you get a new refrigerator, which will go right there. So you get a brand new kitchen here in North Jackson. All right, and then this is the den. It is so big, I gotta get on this side to show it to you. Isn't that nice? Laundry hookups in there. Got some more storage in here. That door goes out to the parking area that's covered in the back. All right, let me go back here then to the, to the living room because I wanna go down this hallway to just, it'll make more sense when I show you the, the, the bedroom bathrooms layout. So you've got from this from from this hallway, you've got a bedroom, a bedroom, a bathroom. Okay, that bedroom still has door access to the kitchen, which you wouldn't have to use if you didn't want to. Okay, and then as you look down the hallway, you've got a bit a bathroom right there, and then two more bedrooms. So this makes for a four bedroom, two full bathroom house. Okay, here's bedroom one. Smells fresh and clean because it's got new carpet, you know, and all fresh paint, new fans, new fixtures. Don't mean to be moving too fast. Hope I'm not making you motion sick. All right, uh, closet right here for some more storage, you know, linens and that kind of thing. Bathroom right here. So we've got new mirror, 